Yeah, I think today's discussion was great because it really brought to light the burden that these employers feel to take care of their people. And what increased costs and increased taxes will really mean uh, to them and the decisions that they have to make to give health care benefits to their employees or being forced to no longer offer them because of the increase in costs. This piece of legislation which was supposed to help needy people essentially, mm -hmm. uh, the reality is it has hit those who it was supposed to help the first and the hardest. Mm -hmm. They want to expand, they want to grow their businesses, they want to have multiple locations, but right now they're sitting on their hands because they don't know what Washington's going to do. The costs are un unsustainable for healthcare, and as a business we look at it, we're waiting for the time where we just say, we're going to be done being the people who are going to figure out health care. We want bills that pass the Senate and they get to the President's desk. And to do that, we have to get senators engaged in this discussion as well. And that is best accomplished by getting individuals and people in our communities engaged and giving them phone calls, writing letters to them, letting them know that this tax is detrimental to them and their families and that they can't afford it and it needs to be repealed.